Well, hello, Bill here, still here. I'm um, taking you for a walk with me because I'm out trying to get my sciatica right, which has been really painful. And you've got to push through the pain barrier a bit because even though it's hurting a lot, I think what it needs is exercise and I haven't been able to do my morning workouts. Hold on, oh, I went wrong. I'm in these woods, not far from where I live, um, but it's very muddy because it's been raining a lot, so I don't come here very often, so I'm losing my way. But yeah, uh, it's been quite difficult with the drugs. God, blimey, the uh, the well, the codeine, the naproxen, the diazepam, the oxycodone. Uh, it's perfect storm I've been feeling yeah, really groggy and tired and also it wasn't having the best effect on my guts either because it uh, sort of does mess things up in that department um, so after only what a couple of days I sort of weaned myself off it I mean even though it's painful I think the feeling I had wasn't great so I'm glad I did it I tried to go just down to paracetamol but it wasn't enough uh, sleeping is the worst it's so painful sleeping uh, with sciatica uh, all down your leg that horrible gnawing pain and you just can't get comfortable so uh, yeah last night I had codeine and I had uh, the diazepam as well to try and help me sleep in the middle of the night and also I've ordered one of those uh, TENS machines which are those electrical pads you put on and it sends electrical pulses around the muscles to sort of it's a bit like acupuncture little needles uh, electronic needles tapping away I've had one for many years which I haven't really used when I got it out last night in the middle of the night to try and get some relief um, all the sticky pads had the gel had gone all manky and horrible so I've ordered another one I feel I might be needing it in the future Anyway, here I am. Look, I've got my sun hat on. This is a special sun hat. Looks like an old man's cloth cap, which it is. But yeah, my daughter got me this some years ago because it's actually uh, got some uh, particular resistance to the sun rays. That's why I'm wearing it. Because we've got a lovely sunny day here in West Wickham. Best day we've had for a long time. And uh, I'm out having a lovely walk. I'd normally be with Helen. She's not with me. She's gone to meet a friend for coffee today. Oh, he tripped over there. That's not going to help with that. Um, look, good news. Had a message. Uh, you get messages these days. It's something called My Chart. It's an app that the National Health Service use now to send you results of uh, things, tests and biopsies and whatnot. Well, those two incisions I've had on my back. Do you remember... Uh, if bring you up to speed, yeah, the original one, which I went larger because that was a malignant melanoma, um, that one clearly was cancerous, uh, so they took more of the tissue around it out to make sure that that was okay. But the other one, where uh, that was sort of up here on the top of my shoulder back, uh, the results come back, it's non-malignant. So that's really good news. Uh, so I'm just waiting now. Yeah, so I read that on the on the app. That's the result. So that's good. Got that result yesterday. I'm now waiting for my next appointments for two more uh, excisions on my back, and then there's three further ones on my my thigh, uh, my leg. Uh, so just waiting for those to come through. So hold on a sec. Just going to switch you off. There's someone coming. Yeah, they're gone now. Nothing worse than someone walking along talking into their phone, is there? Um, so it's a bit rude, I always think. So that's why I switched it off. And, it, and you feel a bit self conscious as well, surprisingly. Um, wow, it's lovely here. Now I'm going to give you a little shot of where the surroundings where I am. Look at that, it's lovely, isn't it? It's only about, what, half a mile a mile up the road from where my house is and uh, I don't often come this way I really should come here more often look the skies are blue it's a beautiful day okay so what's next uh, for me uh, yeah well just waiting for those appointments to come through um, a bit naughty I haven't got my sun cream on I should do 
Did you remember? I should have Mimi. Apologise, I haven't got it on today. But uh, I've got my hat on at least and I'm well covered up. Every part of me, long sleeves, long trousers. So, right, I'm going to check out. I'll let you know when those appointments come through. Take care, everyone. Bye.